I'm Eric from Dynamics, Black Swamp Percussion Drum Foundry, whatever you want, <laughs> whatever you want to call me. And I'm here at the Chicago Drum Show, 22nd annual, and probably the tenth time I've exhibited here under one guise or another. And I've got this kit that is a stainless steel kit, uh, first of its kind, I believe, with with wood inlay. Uh, my friend Mike from Trick Drums helped me out with the shelves, and the uh, stainless steel actually has a, a channel milled in it to accept the stainless steel inlay. This is not just sitting on top of the shelf, you can see. Yeah. And uh, it's a really warm sound, and part of that I think is attributed to the wood hoop, to the hoop plug. Uh, is that maple? It's that solid maple, steam vent maple, with a zebra wood uh, veneer on that. And I've been on a big wood hoop thing for the last couple years. There's a lot of different types of wood hoops. This is actually my newest hoop. It's, it's one single steam fly, steam vent piece of maple. Huh. And so that's a solid wood hoop. This is solid wood hoop. Bent very thick. And then we machine it on the CNC down to this shape. And that's a, as, as opposed to this, which is a segment hoop, which is made up of individual pieces. I see, yeah. Now, is there a difference in sound and price as opposed to uh, those two different styles? The segments are actually going to be more because they're a lot, they're a lot, a lot more time. And these two, material-wise, as far as maple, there's not a lot of money in the, in the wood. All the money is in the labor, and there's a lot of labor in a segment hoop. There's so much preparation that has to go into it. Uh, but these get bent and then glued up and then and then machined, and it's a lot, it's a lot more time efficient. It's a lot less preparation of the wood except for the bending. So what are you selling these uh, for at retail? These will probably be a hundred a pair. A hundred a pair? I think it's a great price for an awesome okay. solid. So this is the first solid shell that I've offered with Dynamics. And what this is, is what I call the unibody shell. And they're the re-ring and the body of the shell is all one. This is all machined out of one piece of wood. And the body, the main, the main wall is three eighths of an inch thick, and then the edge is five eighths. Oh. And it was, I don't know, it was just kind of a challenge. I wanted to do something different. I mean, solid, solid shells are great. I mean, we all know they sound really great, and there's a lot of people that make really great solid shells. And I didn't want to just do something like everyone else was doing. And it's always a challenge to kind of find a new twist on things. Um, and I wanted to dress it up a different way, and I thought. Well, instead of putting a wood inlay, let's do a metal inlay in the wood, and that's that's part of the that's part of the inspiration for doing the wood inlay in the metal for the kit. I like how you integrate the uh, badge into the inlay right there. That's pretty nifty. So this I'm calling this the Unibody series, and this is going along with the Unibody hoops. So between the hoops and the shell, it's only three pieces of wood. Wow. And. Like a lot of us, we do it for the love and not for the money. Uh